let me ask you this question. What touches you the most about life? Oh, what a good question. Um, you're a wonderful interviewer, by the way. Um, what touches me the most about life? I would say life itself, really, um, and how much things want to live. I'm always fascinated uh, driving on a freeway or a highway. If there's just the tiniest little crack in a, a cement, a little green weed will pop up or a little flower wanting to live, you know. And um, there's a lot of, uh, you know, doom and gloom, as I said, in life. But even in the bad times, uh, we have to remember uh, there are hundreds and hundreds and millions of people out in the cemeteries that would love to have just five minutes more of life left or an hour or a day they would take it you know and I write books I think kind of to remind myself and hopefully my readers of that and um, because sometimes I can get busy uh, doing other things or sit and waste my time watching television when I shouldn't be connecting with people and doing uh, human things, enjoying nature. So I'm hoping uh, as I write that in the books um, that I, I get my message as well because um, even with all of the bad things that happen, life is wonderful. Thank you again, Fanny. Wonderful interview as usual. Well, thank you, it's been a real pleasure. We've been talking to Fanny Flagg, whose new book is The Whole Town's Talking.